Hello everyone, Jeff with The Green Review. Uh, today I want to talk about tree root flare. This tree does not have it. This tree looks like it was planted too deep because the trunk goes straight in the ground like a telephone pole. We don't want that. We want the tree root flare to go out where it's visible. We want to be able to see the roots coming off the tree trunk and not have it go straight in the ground like this one. This is the same kind of sugar maple as the other one. This is what the tree root flare should look like. It should go spreading out in all directions from the tree trunk. The other one is buried at least this deep in the, in the ground. Now there, this could be caused by three different problems. It can be that the tree was planted too deep. It can be that there was too much mulch piled up on it. And it can be where a tree ring has been established around the tree and every spring somebody goes through and, and edges and cuts the grass off and piles the dirt up onto the uh, area around the tree and eventually it gets higher and higher onto the tree trunk. Well it's obvious this tree doesn't have any mulch and it doesn't have that tree ring problem so this tree was planted too deep. Now the problem with trees is that you can't read so sometimes the tree will live for many years 10, 15, 20 years before the root system that was trying to grow and trying to grow just finally can't grow enough to be able to support the top. The top starts getting problems and then the tree eventually dies much earlier than it should have. The other problems that develop on the tree because it doesn't have a good balance between the top and the bottom become the problem that, that kill it and they're the, they're the ones that get the blame instead of the person who installed it in the first place planting it too deep much earlier. And so if you ever see a tree that doesn't have the root flare, it looks like it was a telephone pole planted into the ground. If it's got mulch on it, take the mulch off. If it's got the soil piled up, take that off. But if it's planted too deep, then there's really not much you can do. If it's small, you might be able to replant it by digging it up and starting over again, getting it at the right height. But if it's a larger one like this, all you can do is try to keep the problems that are on the top from developing and continuing to kill the tree. This is Jeff for The Green Review. Thanks for watching.